Hi everyone, welcome to Bond Bites, a daily bond market highlights for Vinal Bonds. I'm Arjun Patsarthi, and in today's market, markets are flat. Gee, uh, government bond yields and the rupee was steady, were steady. Uh, largely, the Fed has indicated that asset purchases will soon start to reduce uh, as they start to taper their asset purchase program. And uh, in the Indian market news, you have the Bharat Bond uh, ETF, uh, which is the exchange traded fund uh, the government is planning to uh, raise another rupees 10000 crores or rupees 100 billion through a fresh issue of bharat bond etf now for those who, of you who are not aware or want to know the finer intricacies of bharat bond etf uh, definitely inr bonds has got all the knowledge about the etf in its platform however i will explain it uh, in a bit uh, for you to understand easily. So ETFs are exchange traded funds where you buy the uh, where you buy into an index of bonds. And the Bharat Bond ETF is constructed with an index of PSU bonds. PSU bonds are uh, are bonds that are issued by government owned enterprises. And uh, so, so given that they are issued by government owned enterprises, and the best most of the, most of the bonds are issued by in the ETF. Are issued are uh, are of the best uh, government-owned enterprises. Uh, the 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 risk is very low in ETFs. That, that is the credit risk. However, the ETFs are of maturities of uh, five and ten years. There is even a, a maturity of two-year maturity bond, uh, uh, or even uh, slightly lower, because well, the first ETF was issued about a couple of years back, and. Uh, uh, with this, uh, this will be the third tranche of Bharat Bond ETF. ETFs are, uh, Bharat Bond ETF is a good option for investors looking to invest in a uh, fixed income portfolio of very high quality, uh, with uh, of very high quality. And also they get the benefit of, uh, uh, of uh, taxation, uh, 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 taxation, as these ETFs are of uh, five and ten year uh, of, of longer maturities, and uh, they are treated like uh, uh, they are listed on the exchange and traded like equities, so they get the benefit of that taxation as well. So investors are finding favor with Bharat Bond ETFs, and uh, a lot of investors do invest in Bharat Bond ETF. The only drawback is that when interest rates rise, the price of the ETF falls, and in the current inflationary environment. There is a lot of strong expectations that interest rates are going to rise as we go along, and ETF prices could fall uh, if investors want to sell the ETFs uh, before maturity. Then they might have to uh, get lower returns, uh, given that prices could fall. So that's the only drawback. And uh, yes, I mean INR bonds is the best place to uh, come to uh, come to read about and know all about Bharat Bond ETFs also uh, to, uh, uh, and uh, how the ETFs have behaved since issuance, etc. Uh, also, don't forget to log in to our uh, retail bond platform, electronic bond platform, Quick Invest, where we offer, the, offer a curated list of bonds with our own uh, risk score and uh, ease of transaction with a lot of information and transparency and uh, and uh, best in class information as a and research and information thank you very much for listening